Plain is closing its doors tonight. Freeman Jewelers employed four generations of the family and served countless customers for nearly 70 years. News Channel 15's Carrie Houston spoke with the owners today and joins us now with more. Well, Mark and Heather, the Freeman family first announced that they would be closing back in November. The final day of business today was a tough one for them and their customers. Many people count their jewelers among their family's most trusted service providers. Who knows how many customers over nearly 70 years have picked out precious treasures for their loved ones at Freeman's. You get to go through people's wedding anniversaries, first babies, confirmation. Young men, usually they're terrified to begin with and making sure that they make a memory when they give the, their fiance their engagement ring. They always love to tell the story and just developing personal contacts and relationships with people. The business's three owning partners, two brothers and a sister, are selling off the building at DuPont and Auburn Park Drive. Their father first opened back in 1946 at First and Wells Streets. My father was a watchmaker in the Army, so after he got the training, he came out of World War II, and then, of course, now I have a trade, and he came to Fort Wayne. In 1964, Freeman's moved to Fifth and Wells. With the price of gold, it hovers around twelve to $1,300. That made such a difference in the price of everything that it cut out a lot of people. And uh, even though the economy has come back, you know, salaries haven't really kept up with that. Health problems convinced the brothers and their sister it was time to retire. Fort Wayne been good to you? Fort Wayne's been real good to us for the years. Well Street was a real good street to us for a lot of years. I want to thank everybody for that. It's just been uh, very nice meeting all the people, having them put their trust in us. They'll just be missed, and we just thank them very, very much for being not only our friends, but uh, being our customers. So. The Freemans quit the business that has employed four generations of their family. But they leave knowing they were valued by the countless people they helped create the most precious memories of their lives. Freeman Jewelers closes its doors tonight at 6 p.m. Carrie Houston, News Channel 15.